Sharing a moment of life with the spruce grouse is like dreaming and yet being awake. It's magical. From an artistic point of view, it's been an extraordinary experience because I could examine its plumage and even smell the scent of its feathers. It was like a gift from nature. It made it possible for me to add another dimension to my paintings. I've often returned to watch this mysterious bird I came to name Woody. You keep following me? His behavior was the manifestation of an exceptionally aggressive animal. He attacked anything he felt was invading his territory. He had but one thing in mind, chase me away at any cost. Each movement of the head is accompanied by a loud spreading of tail. The male's motions as controlled as those of a little robot. By striking with his beak, the cock wants to attract attention. In his language, this means, pay attention to me. After imprinting their mother's voice and image, the chicks start exploring the area. After all those hours of fasting, the mother famished. She tries nibbling at the edible plants within her reach, plants which previously served as camouflage. Sometimes the cock does surprising things during the courtship. I was astonished to see the cock use me in his spectacular staging. Actually, it was a normal situation. Because I was motionless, I was part of the scenery, like any tree trunk or stump in the underbrush. An artist is precisely someone who has to observe keenly. So, the spruce grouse and I agreed on our respective roles. I admired him, while he was happy to be admired. The sound effect of the drumming comes from the movement of the air propelled by the wings. This creates a backward pressure, forcing the bird to hang on the log the best it can, 